Now we will study about potential difference between two points in a circuit. So let us draw a circuit where I am going to mark two points like A and B. So how will you define the potential difference between two points A and B? The potential difference between two points A and B is the work done by the battery to move a charge from a point A to point B. Once again to repeat, it's the work done by the battery to move a charge from A to B. So it's the work done per unit charge. From that we get the concept and definition of potential difference. So what is the definition of potential difference? It is the work done in bringing a charge from a particular point of a circuit to another point. So potential difference is denoted by the letter V. So how can we create the mathematical equation from this particular definition? So what we have said? V is equal to the work done per unit charge. So what is it? Potential difference V is equal to the work done per unit charge. So here we get the mathematical equation of potential difference. So what is the mathematical equation for potential difference? V is equal to W by Q. So what is V? It's the potential difference. What is W? It's the work done. And what is Q? The charge moved. So a simple example. I'll do it with a numerical. Suppose there is a battery of 50 volt working and it is moving a charge of 2 coulomb. What is the work done? So that is the question to you. So what is it? The work done will be we know that V is equal to W by Q. We are asked to find out what is W. So W is equal to V into Q. So what is this V? It is 50 and what is this Q? It is 2 coulomb. So 50 into 2 it is 100. And you know that this is the work done. What is the unit of work done? You know it is joule. So here the work done is calculated as 100 joule. So coming back to the unit of potential difference. So what is the unit of potential difference? So we know that the equation is V is equal to W by Q. So when we put the unit for W it is joule. And what is the unit of Q? It is coulomb. So the unit of potential difference is joule per coulomb. Then this joule per coulomb corresponds to a unit called volt. So it is denoted by capital V. Why it is given the unit as volt? It is to honor the great scientist Alexandro Volta. So the unit of potential difference is volt and another unit can be joule per coulomb. As we have done in our earlier classes, there can be a question, define 1 volt. So what is it? 1 volt is the potential difference maintained between two points in a circuit when 1 joule of work is done to move a charge of 1 coulomb between these points. Now we will discuss how to measure the potential difference in a circuit. The instrument which helps us to measure the potential difference in a circuit is called a voltmeter. So in a circuit a voltmeter is uh, drawn like this, like this. So if there is a bulb here and we want to measure the potential difference between the two ends of the bulb, we are connecting this voltmeter in this way and this connection is called parallel connection. 
So please note when a voltmeter is connected, this voltmeter positive side should be connected at the same side of the battery's positive terminal while you do the experiments in your practical lab. That's all for this video. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you.